Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpsami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpsami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Welcome everybody guys, uh, this is daily video from the forexpsami.com. Today again we will take a look at the euro currency. Uh, situation becomes more interesting uh, since we, we have new inputs here guys. So actually yesterday I just uh, have missed one pattern that could become really important for your currency in the short term perspective. So I intentionally have increased the, the scale of this chart. So yesterday we mostly have taken a look at this picture. But right now we have more details right at the bottom. So take a look what we have. Uh, yes, we, we have we were expecting to get this here double repo buy pattern or something that could trigger some meaningful retracement up. So this part of the setup is still the same. So we're still continue to watch for a possible reversal patterns, short term patterns that could trigger retracement here. That's the, that's no pro no problems with that. But the problem is uh, mostly with the market behavior and how definitely it could form this potential reversal pattern uh, if the if uh, of course any pattern will be formed so uh, take a look that re yesterday we have missed discussion of this pattern that really could be important or better to say we have talked about this pattern but only as on the high wave pattern uh, but we have missed another feature of this pattern as you can see this is in fact bearish grabber so market here, this red line is the MACD predictor. So um, as you can see, yes, the market has tried, not yesterday, on Friday, market has tried to shift trend to the bullish side but failed and closed below the MACD predictor line. It means that this is the grabber, guys, and the, the patient, the target of this patient stands right here at this lows. So minimum target of this patient is taken out of these lows. How definitely this take out will happen, we do not know whether this will be real breakout and market will continue dropping or that will be just the stop hunting the market will grab the stops below one or five uh, and then return at the big up. it's difficult to say right right now but importancy of this pattern also stands with these lows guys so you can see that that line is in fact long-term lows on the weekly charts one or five even and simultaneously as market will taken out of these laws, it's definitely will taken out the major laws. That's why this meaning of this grabber could be really special. It's a really important pattern. This pattern will be valid until this top will hold. So market could erase this pattern only if it will move above it, above this top. And this is very interesting how to combine this pattern with the hand and shoulders pattern on the intraday charts that we have talked about yesterday. Uh, this is really tricky moment, guys. So, uh, but first, let's focus on the potential double repo buy pattern, and particular speaking, this grammar. Here, guys, we uh, show you the possible setup that will be suitable as for double repo pattern, as for bearish grammar. And this setup, of course, the butterfly buy pattern. So, take a look at the four-hour time frame chart. This is particularly the pattern that could become the reality and it will match the expectation of both patterns. First of all, <coughs> I would like to say again uh, that that case will be the favorite shape, my favorite shape of the double repo. I like when the double repo consolidation takes the part, takes the shape of the butterfly on the intraday charts. Why? By two, by, by two moments. First of all, because market with the forming the butterfly creates the new low the, the second bottom of the consolidation of the double repo will be slightly lower than the first one. And this is a good sign for the double repo. Second, a butterfly gives you chance to take the position right at the bottom and to not expect, uh, to, not, to, wait, uh, to not wait for confirmation of the double repo by the Judd Napoli. The Judd Napoli framework suggests that you should wait when the market will close above the 3x3 three three again. So we have the first close above the 3x3, three three, then when it close below, and if butterfly will be formed, this close will be lower than that one. This is a good sign. And after that, you need another close above to get the confirmation of the double repo pattern. But when you have the butterfly, you could take position based on the butterfly. 
and in this case you will have the position right at the bottom. After that you need just to control whether you will get the close about the 3x3 or not. And when you, and if you will get it, you already could protect your position with the break-even stop. So that's why I like the consolidation of the double ripple when it takes the shape of the of the butterfly. Uh, simultaneously, guys, the butterfly will uh, satisfy the both conditions. First of all, if it will be formed, and this take these laws will be taken out and grubber will be completed on the daily chart. Second. The appearing of the butterfly will not cancel the potential double ripple by a patron. Uh, that's why we think that's really very probable scenario here. Uh, one moment here exists that take a look. In fact, here we also have some bullish grabbers, and they haven't reached the target yet. The target of these grabbers is st stands above this top, and these grabbers suggest the taking out and the raising of the daily patron. But here, guys, we should take into consideration one important moment that the high time frames are more valuable and stronger than overall the low time frames. That's why the stop grabber on the daily chart has more value than on the intraday charts. And that's why, particularly, this pattern on the daily chart is more uh, is our primary pattern, but not that one. Besides, here we have just one pattern. Here, all of other grabbers have been erased by this drop. Um, Second moment here on the daily chart, on the four hour time frame chart, take a look. Here we have minor candlestick bearish patterns, reversal pattern, and calls of the evening star. So, minor candle here is perfect shape. Doji at the top between them and candle down. So, three candle pattern that suggests further downward action. Either minor, either a real continuation, but it really could happen. And appearing here, uh, the reversal pattern, if we suggest this market should take it out of this top, seems not quite logical. So it, this pattern suggests downward reversal and downward continuation. That's why, guys, personally, I think that the chances on appearing of the butterfly here and that this pattern will work seems to me more uh, probable than market will just showing this upward action right now. That's just my 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 view on the on the on the situation. Besides, dealing with these patrons much safer than trying to take position on the long side of right now because currently, guys, you do not have any other patrons. You have potential butterfly against you. You have daily grabber against you, uh, and the double repo hasn't been formed yet. That's why taking the long position right now seems a bit risky. So, uh, returning back to the discussion of the hand shoulders that we have. So yesterday we said that if you will take long position here, you will get the chance to possess yourself with the minimum risk. Because this is the point of the minimal risk when you're trying to trade the hand shoulders. If you have taken long position here, that's great. So just either contract your stop, move your stop to the break even or just take the profit. Because with the situation that we have on the daily chart, uh, currently it's uh, chances on the real success of this head and shoulders patterns looks not quite uh, significant. That's why make a decision by yourself uh, how it better to do uh, for you or maybe take the part on the half take breath on the half your position rest the uh, second half with the break, in, break even stop loss. So this is another opportunity. Um, but uh, with the new details that we have right now on the euro currency it seems that the more probable appearing of the butterfly here taking out of these laws and only after that maybe market will turn to some uh, retracement based on the double repo pattern. Uh, besides, currently, guys, based on this head and shoulders pattern that we have, yes, market indeed has reached the neckline here, but right now it stands to some retracement down. Although here we would like to get the real breakout, uh, upper breakout. Um, the only pattern that I see here that could be formed, maybe some kind of the butterfly, uh, if our suggestion on uh, probable our reaction is wrong. So, uh, just let's keep watching what will happen with this patient. But as I said, with those patients that we just have discussed, the chance on the real breakout and completion of this uh, hand and shoulders um, right now not real significant. That, be that being said, for those of you who haven't taken the long position yesterday yet, and uh, if you are still searching the chance for trading of the euro currency on the long side, just wait. Wait when the market will form this butterfly that we have. 
here and then we will return back to this discussion and uh, we'll decide how better to take long position on this market if market will form the butterfly and we will get the double repo pattern here. If you already have the long position and you have taken it based on this hand and shoulders, as I said, you could make the you have the a lot of different scenarios that you could follow. Uh, so most simple is just uh, move your stop to the break even and just watch what will happen. If market will drop here, that's okay. You you will lose nothing and get the second chance for taking the long uh, on our scenario with the butterfly. Uh, if market will complete this patient wall, that also will be great because you will get the profit. Uh, other scenarios is just, for example, take the profit on half of the position and move your stop to the break even on the second half, or just fix the profit here. So. It's, 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 a, it's, a, it's a pleasant choice because here your position should be in, in plus so that's why uh, nothing presses on you uh, just you could make the decision on this subject by yourself just keep in, uh, uh, keep in mind uh, this, uh, these uh, ideas that we have discussed right now especially on the butterfly and uh, on this bearish grabber that we have on the daily chart because this is very important uh, very important pattern so that's all what we would like to say today again on, on the euro currency. Let's see how situation will develop.